Greetings, I hope this message finds you all well. My name is Flip Mentor, son of Parnell and Angela Mentor. Uh, and I've been asked or summons to uh, send a message on behalf of the Brothers for Life. And when I say uh, summons, I think many of y'all know that Angela Mentor can be very convincing in her ask or it's essentially a request uh, for you to do something. So uh, with that, out of respect for my parents and out of my mind specifically, uh, I wanted to send a message on behalf of Brothers for Life. Our Brothers for Life is a ministry under the umbrella of Sisters for Life. Uh, this summer, my mother had asked me to uh, begin to do the radio broadcast. And through doing the radio broadcast, uh, where we talk about Sisters for Life and, and what the ministry is about, uh, I was able to give a greater level of insight in regards to what Sisters for Life means and what the pro-life movement is about and what and how God views this issue. Uh, and what I recognize is that uh, I wanted to be on the right side of it, the righteous side of the issue, uh, and that's God, and that's, and that's giving life. Because, you know, the, God, the Lord came to give life and to give you life more abundantly. And he also says that uh, before I formed you in the womb, I knew you. And he also uh, was an individual who was birthed out of unconventional, untraditional and very tough circumstances. Uh, but his parents still gave him life. So through that, I recognize that regardless of the situation, regardless of unplanned or planned pregnancies, uh, God is able uh, to keep us. And that's the ministry that Sisters for Life is about. That's the message that Sisters for Life uh, brings. And that's what Brothers for Life brings is uh, the male's perspective and giving the male a voice on this issue. Because it's important I know that the, the male has a voice in this, in the, um, in the pro-life and in the and in the choice that these women, that women make and the families make. Uh, so often uh, when you hear about the in family court, uh, you hear about how important the man is and how important the man's uh, uh, ability to, pro to provide is but however when it comes to the the right to life uh the man is essentially almost told to to take a step back uh, to be quiet this isn't your issue this is the woman's issue uh and i find that very conflicting because i think it's both of our issues and i think it's important that we understand that and, and the man has a place and that's why i'm glad that, that my mother angela mentor has allowed has asked me uh, to come up and speak and to uh be a voice for the voices and be a voice for the men uh, because it's important that we are and it's important that we are on the right side of this issue, which is the righteous side uh, So that's that's what pro-life. That's what brothers for life is doing right now I'm actually out here in Los Angeles, California where there's very it's very liberal very a lot of free thinkers and that's good uh, But although we should be free thinkers and have free will uh, Our beliefs on the issues of life should remain intact and my life, my issues, and my and my thoughts on the issue of life have remained intact uh, while I've been here. Uh, I've been ministering to individuals and talking about uh, what it means uh, to be to be a an individual who supports bringing bringing life into this world. Uh, and also, I'm actually a mental health therapist. I'm actually a clinical psychology intern right now at the largest mental health jail in the country. And uh, I understand how important it is for individuals to have uh, mental health needs met if they decide to terminate their pregnancy or if they decide to choose pre choose to keep their child. You know, because Sisters for Life is here for people who decide to terminate their pregnancy. We're not ones that's gonna go out and say, well, you killed your baby, we're done with you. No, we're still here to stay alongside of you and support you in every, in every way that we can uh, so that the next time, you know, you, 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 you're in a position to, to bring life into this world, you have a different uh, way of thinking. You've had your mind renewed. You know, and that's what we're and that's how we're all about. That's what Angela Mentor is about. That's what the ministry is about. Uh, to renew our minds about this issue. Because a lot of times we kind of have these thoughts that, you know, hey, it's a woman's choice. You know, who are we to say? Uh, but as we renew our minds and we hear more about it, if we read more about it, if we read, if we read our word more, we recognize uh, how God wants us to think. And it's important that we choose life. And it's important that we have a voice. And it's important that men have a voice. And it's important that we sow into ministries as well. You know, it's important because if you don't sow, you can't you can't uh, reap the, the 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 produce and the fruit of it. So it's important the individual is so into this ministry monetarily, you know. And this this is this all these things, all this stuff goes to all the money and everything that that you all sow into the ministry goes back into the community, goes back into this world, and it goes back into doing the things that God wants us to do, doing the things that God is uh, uh, God God wants us to do with our life, our purpose. So recognize that, recognize this is a good ground. The ministry is a good ground. Angela Mentor, Angela Mentor, Angela Mentor is, a, uh, is a good ground to sow into. 
so with that, I'll just let you all know that I'm, like I said, I'm Flip Mentor, son of Angela and Parnell Mentor, and I'm part of the Brothers for Life team. Uh, and, it's, and it's an amazing ministry, and it's, and it's showing me so much about what God's views are on the issue of life and the man's role within it. So you all be blessed. Uh, hope you all have a great night, uh, and you all stay blessed.